Hello everyone, welcome to Magical Nang Umma. In today's video, I'll be teaching you step by step some full algorithm to solve every by three Rubik's Cube. First, before we start solving the Rubik's Cube, you have to familiarize yourself with the cube rotations. How they are moved, what are the pieces called, and how the moves goes. First, the cube consists of six sides, and each, and each side consists of a unique color. The white color, the orange color, the blue color, the green color, the yellow color and the red color and we have three kind of pieces we have the center pieces the edge pieces and the corner pieces the center pieces are the pieces that represent the colors which is cannot be swapped we have six center pieces the center of the green yellow orange blue white and red the edges these are the edges and the edges can only be swapped with the edges and we have the corner pieces the corner pieces contain of three colors. And what are the cube notations? When we say right, we mean when we say R, we mean right. When we say U, we mean up. When we say face, we mean the front. When we say left, we mean the left hand side. When we say back, we mean the back side. When we say the bottom, we mean down. And what are the moves? When we say later with an apostrophe I means that the move will be contact clockwise or inverted meaning when we say right is when we say right inverted when we say left is when we say l inverted which is left when we say up when we say up inverted down down inverted first Has inverted. These are the cube notation. So this is the right time to start solving the Rubik's cube. The cube is scrambled. The first stage of solving the Rubik's cube is to choose your favorite color. And after you choose your favorite color, then you have to make a white cross. In my case, I choose white as my favorite color. What it means that you choose your favorite color is that if I choose white, I will start with this side because white is in the center. If I choose the orange, I will start with this because orange is in the center. If I choose yellow, I will start with this because the yellow is in the center. So I choose my white as my favorite color. And after you choose your color, then you have to make the cross of such color. In my case, I will, I will be making a white cross. I may be in your case to make a red cross, yellow cross, whatever cross. So first, look at the edges that have white on it. This have white. This also have white. This also have white. So I have my white cross. But this cross is wrong because I want the edge and the center to be matched. So as you can see, white, white, green, green. So I want white, white, blue, blue. So take off this blue down. Align it with the center of the blue. Also, this is red. Take it where the red is. It off. This is orange. Take it off. Now, as you can see, white, white, blue, blue, white, white, orange, orange, white, white, green, green, white, white, red, red. So it's the right time to go for the second move. The second move is the top corners. Picks in all these corners to be perfectly matched. Mm -hmm. In this case, <coughs> We will start with our first algorithm, which is right inverted, down inverted, right down, right inverted, down inverted, right down. It goes like this. In this case, I want yellow, white, red, the blue. And here it is. Right inverted, down inverted, right down. Right inverted, down inverted, right down. Right inverted, down inverted, right down. As you can see now, it's fixed. And check this step down. 
I need white, orange, and green. Here it is, but triangle oriented. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. 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 As you can see, it's fixed. I want white, blue, and orange. Here it is. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. It's fixed. I want green and red. Here it is. Perform the algorithm. The third stage is make a T-letter. In making a T-letter, it's like that my T-letter cannot contain my bottom letter. In this case, my bottom color is yellow. And then in making my T, it will not consist of yellow color. As you can see, this is letter T, the T that consists with an orange. And in this case, we have two scenarios. We are either sending it to the left or we are sending it to the right. In this case, I will be sending it to the right. And the algorithm goes like this. Down inverted, right inverted, down inverted, right, down, face, down, face inverted. Now I have fixed this. Then I should go again and make another letter T. This is red T. And I will be sending it to the right. I will be fixing this to this. Down inverted, right inverted, down inverted, right, down, face, down, face inverted. This cannot work because it contains my bottom color. This cannot work, it contains my bottom color. This cannot work, this cannot work. Another green T. And I will be sending it to the right again. Then, in this case, I will be sending to the left, and the algorithm goes like this. Down, left, down, left inverted, down inverted, face inverted, down inverted, face. And the second layers are fixed, the edges and the centers. Now is a good time to go for the fourth move, and the first move is the bottom cross. In making the bottom cross, I want these edges to be cos as we have did in the previous one. So the algorithm goes like this. F U R off inverted, right inverted, face inverted. Then I have my yellow cos. And if you don't have your yellow cos, continue until you have created the yellow cos with the same algorithm. The next move is orienting the edges and the corners. As you can see, I have orient the, this edge with this corner and it's matched. Then keep one in your right hand side and the push one away from you and perform this move. Right, up, right inverted, up, right, double up, right inverted, up. As you can see, all the edges and the corners are matched. Then the last, the last move is orienting and making the corners. As you can see, we want yellow, red, and green. And this is it, but it's strongly oriented. This is it, but it's strongly oriented. This is it, but it's strongly oriented. How can we solve it? This is the move. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down, right inverted, down inverted, right, down, right inverted, down inverted, right, down, right. Until I fixed. Repeat the algorithm until all one move to complete the tube.